Each week, we bring you coverage of great high school football games in and around North Alabama. We also recognize outstanding performances with our weekly First Down Friday Night MVP Award. This week's recipient received multiple nominations. Here's Nick Kuzma with his story. Take care of business. That's just what Decatur Heritage football did last week in a 68-0 region victory over Tharp Town. And Eagles head coach Nikita Stover says he liked that his team stayed focused in the route. Well, Tharp Town is a young team and uh, we knew, you know, they were struggling with us. So just working on what we needed to do and polishing up new things that we need that we wanted to work on, you know, going forward in the season. At the center of it all was but a Taylor. The sophomore affected the game in multiple ways, scoring two touchdowns on the ground and how a kickoff return for another touchdown and this is how he prepared for the season. I just practice hard and really that's it. Just work outside or practice and just stay focused. Yeah, I don't matter what's going on. It, it don't matter. You know, it's like come play on this concrete. He gonna come play on it. For his efforts, Taylor has been named the first down Friday night MVP of the week, which is brought to you by Whataburger. The sophomore says he hopes to play college football one day and his head coach is very complimentary of his on-field work ethic. He always been a uh, you know, quiet guy, but works hard. Uh, you know, sp small in statue, but like he, he plays like he's about 6'2", 220, like the way he hit, the way he run around, you know, he's our fastest kid, uh, and he works hard. The Eagles are currently on a bye week and continue the regular season on October 4th at Falkville. Indicator, I'm Nick Kuzma, Fox 54 Sports. Speaking of high school football, don't forget to check out a 60-minute edition of First Down Friday Night this Friday following college football on Fox. We'll have all the high school highlights from across the Tennessee Valley, and we'll also have your college football previews. That's this Friday following the conclusion of Rutgers and Washington right here on Fox 54.